Welcome to the tutorial, Configuration of the Web Server IIS for Aparo Fast Edit. For the preparation of the configuration, we have to create the right ISAPI DLL file. There are two files in the folder CGI bin and we need to rename the right one. When using the 64-bit Windows version, we have to check the used application pool. Go to Application Pools and select the used one. Click on the right side on Advanced Settings. If the setting Enable 32-bit application is set to true, then you must use the file IIS underline fast edit underline 32-bit dot DLL. If you use a 32-bit Windows, then you must select the file IIS underline fast edit underline 32-bit DLL. Now copy the right file and rename it to IIS underline fast edit dot DLL. The first step is to create the virtual directory named Aparo. Right click on default website and select add virtual directory. Insert the name in the field alias and select as physical path the folder CGI bin in the Aparo home folder. In the second step, we have to edit the feature permissions. Select the folder Aparo and double click on handler mappings. Now click on Edit Feature Permissions and make sure that all permissions are granted. Then click on Add Module Mapping and enter star.dll into Request Path. Select ISAPI Module in Modules, select the just created DLL as executable and name it Aparo. Select the server name and double click on ISAPI and CGI restrictions. Depending on the IIS version, there is already a permission created. If there is such permission created, select as file the renamed DLL and allow the extension path to execute. We suggest naming it Aparo. Select default website and double click on ISAPI filters. Click on Add, select the renamed DLL and name it Aparo. As the last step, you have to restart the IIS. If you want to use an own application pool instead of the default app pool, you have to perform additional steps. We create the application pool named Aparo for this demonstration. Right click the Aparo folder and select Convert to Application, then select the desired application pool. The default website must use the same application pool as set for the Aparo application. Select the default website and click on Advanced Settings, then change the first entry. This will have no impact on other applications like IBM Cognos. The last step is to stop and start the IIS.